sounds like extremely sketchy. Because it's a sketchy game. Oh. Lauren Winter. Ring any bells? Nope. Can't say it does. Or a jammy. <laughs> How about no? Oh, that I Lauren Winter. It. Third what a floor, cheap whore. Last door on the left at the end of the corridor. Like, oh, I didn't hear what he said. Door on the left at the end of the corridor. What a cheap whore that man. So up the stairs? Yes, dear. <laughs> <laughs> You've been around dad too much. <laughs> yes, dear. I say that to Alec all the time. Oh, a dramatic cut of you walking up the stairs. The last door on the left? Yeah. You better be ready for some uh, fucking uh, quick time events. Lauren Winter. Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. Or. Wait. It's fifty bucks. Jesus. I don't kiss and I don't <laughs> do any weird shit. Fine by me. Put your money on the table. You got exactly 10 minutes when the alarm rings, it's over, okay? How good? This is not good. It's, how do I put my money on the table? <laughs> He'll do it afterwards, don't worry. Just uh. go afterwards. <laughs> or else you'll be walking around this table you for the next You should take your clothes minutes. off, we ain't got all day. Actually, I'm not a customer. Oh, shit, a cop. I should've known, what do you want, a freebie? Is that it? My name is Scott Shelby. I'm a private detective. The yeah. families of the victims of the origami killer asked me to investigate the murders. I came here just to ask you some questions about Johnny. There's one guy, Norman I already Jayden. told the police all I know and have Norman nothing Jayden. to add. He says origami, Leave me alone. like origami. Oh God. No, oh, geez. Are you gonna be a good PI? Are you deaf? I have nothing to say to you. Get out of here. I understand, Lauren. Oh. I know what you're going through. a good cop. And then a bad oh, yeah? cop. Do you Maybe know what we'll it feels like to find your own trophy. son's body on a wasteland? I'm sorry, I don't believe you have the slightest idea what I'm going through, Mr. Shelby. Mr. Shelby. The killer is walking around free as we speak. He'll kill again if he's not arrested. Hey, Johnny's dead, so what difference does it make? A lot, you dumb bitch. If we don't find the killer, there'll be other mothers who find their son's body on a deserted wasteland. Good. Good. But, but, but you're right. Why should you care? It's not your problem anymore, right? Can you imagine having a mother as a prostitute? A prostitute as a mother? <laughs> mother as a prostitute. No, that's not right. right. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> mother as a Oh God. I understand what I said. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Uh, that's what I said. Can you imagine having a mother as a prostitute? I'll say this the whole time. I wonder what you little Bobby's doing. Right with the now. kids after school. <laughs> Shut up. Fingers pouring down something <laughs> awful that day. I'm done. I'll never forget it. <laughs> I'm done. I'd shut up. All his friends came home around five. All except Can him. Can you imagine though? Having a mother as a prostitute. Yes. God, that their life would suck. Of course, I made sure he never met any of my clients. I wanted to stop, you know. But we needed the money. I was trying to earn enough to get us out of here. Slut. You want one? No thanks, I quit. That's brave. Got asthma. Tell me about Johnny. What kind of kid was he? Johnny was really a shit. good boy. <laughs> <laughs> God, wait. Sometimes he, he, hangs out he with fought with he other kids. With Sean. Sean. And Jason. And Jason. That's where they got their attitude. In from. his own way, I think he understood what was going on. Well, it's this still about fifteen hundred dollars. When did you sound the alarm? Christmas About eight o'clock. Like 
I began to get worried. I went all around the neighborhood. I went to the wasteland where they like to play. I went to see his Did friends. You imagine that? Where are your kids? Oh, they're playing in the wasteland. I called the cops about 10 o'clock. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Mommy, look what I found. Huge heroin needles. Yeah. Time's up. Time's up, Mr. Shelby. I hope you got what you wanted. I wanted to get out of here. Father, but I didn't get the chance. Sarah's getting into it. I can tell because you're going really quiet because you're trying to pay attention. Put the money on the table. Get out well, if you remember anything, apartment. the smallest detail, give me a call. You didn't even pay her. You're better. I didn't get any sex until she was. <laughs> She gave you information. I want out. I want out. That is not a door. That's not a door. That's the door. There you go. No. There you go. Got it. Nailed it. It's a camera right there. I wonder what happened there. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder if you get how far away Pockets on my coat. Breathe. Lauren. Uh, Lauren, open up, baby. It's me. Troy, what are you doing here? I already told you I don't want to see you anymore. Sorry, Dal, but I really wanted to see ya. Oh, now I'm gonna have to go help guys. <laughs> yeah, you are. Prepare yourself. Fuck! Prepare yourself for quick time events. What do you want, asshole? Lauren, is everything all right? Clearly. She's just swell. Now beat it, loser! Uh, oh, you bad. again? If you're looking for trouble, oh, you it. Right? Yeah. Kind of. Yeah. He too. Better than him, I guess. Who is he? An ex client who thinks he owns me. That's Troy. He was getting violent, and I told him I didn't want to see him anymore. Uh, you should be careful. He'll probably be back. Sorry about the mess. <laughs> Mr. Shelby. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. <laughs> no, thanks. Peace out. Oh. Peace out, motherfucker. I just had an asthma attack. Like, you did. I probably shouldn't have been fighting. No. Oh, we got him, Jaden. Okay, this is gonna be too long. You gonna stop? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna cut it. <laughs> we're gonna save it. Cut it. Thanks for watching if you watched. If you didn't, well, you know, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> we're over it. 
Bye. Bye.